Hi, I'm Bruce Wilson, Chemistry Product Manager at Carolina Biological Supply Company. Today we're going to perform a reduction oxidation reaction from our kit, Sealator Silver. The kit includes copper wire and silver nitrate solution. You'll also need a pen and a beaker. Also, be sure to wear safety eyewear and gloves when you perform this demonstration. Silver ions will stain skin. In the reaction, you're going to see silver form on copper wire. This reaction is an example of a reduction oxidation or redox reaction. In the reaction, the silver ion will oxidize the copper metal to form silver metal and copper ions. The solution will turn blue because copper ions are blue in water. To get started, wrap one end of the copper wire around a pin and let the rest of the wire hang from the side of the beaker. Pour silver nitrate solution into the beaker. Immediately, you'll see silver particles form on the wire. Also, you'll see the solution turn blue. What's happening? In a reduction oxidation reaction, one reactant is oxidized while the other reactant is reduced. In this reaction, silver ion is the oxidizing agent. Silver ions oxidize the copper metal to form copper two ions. As the silver oxidizes the copper, the silver is reduced to silver metal. Metal ions are good oxidizers. Copper two ions, for example, will oxidize iron. Place an iron nail in a solution of copper two sulfate. The copper will coat the nail and the solution will turn colorless. Why does the solution turn colorless? As copper plates the nail, the concentration of copper two ions in the solution decreases and the solution turns colorless. As we've seen, silver ion oxidizes copper and copper ion oxidizes iron. This kit contains enough materials to do the experiment five times. Be sure to keep the silver nitrate bottle in the dark or wrap it with foil. Light can reduce the silver ions to elemental silver. Carolina offers other experiments for performing reduction oxidation reactions. Visit www.carolina.com for this and other experiments.